what's up everybody, it's Nerp here, and today we're going to do some spectating. Um, a ring task we're going to watch, and many of you guys like the, the series, so I think I'll do another one today. Uh, look at my weekly winner right thing right there, so cool, it's the second time I got the weekly winner for that one. And we're going to watch this match between Rocket Appliance and Excalibur. Uh, 1571 and 1614, so pretty average ratings, not too low, but not high at all. And um, Excalibur, uh, he plays and he played in like a bunch of the tournaments before. Uh, he's a very, he's I know he's a a decent player. And Rocket Appliance, I haven't seen him play, but a 1571 rating is very middle middle of the road, so he can't be too bad. And so it looks like Mono Growth versus Mono. What was it? Was it Energy? I think it was. No, it was DK. I don't even know what it was. Let me see what it was. <laughs> mono Order. No, Mono Growth versus Mono Order. Okay. Um and let's see let's go back into this so uh rallying breaker rack king ventral better um it's decent starting and uh you probably want to sacrifice the rallying and go play the ventral better breaker racking curve but uh let me just talk a little bit about what's going on so today's this is thursday's video yesterday i did a night the test i actually just recorded a bunch of grave lock stuff on the test server but i noticed afterwards my mic was off for the entire video so i was so annoyed and i don't feel like doing more great box now so you guys won't get to see that sadly but um there'll be no videos on saturday or sunday and possibly monday i don't know um there will be a video tomorrow which will be the top place of the week so definitely check that out it's gonna be awesome but this weekend i will be able to record new videos so yeah um i think i will be helping out with uh, blinky's 24 hour stream on friday slash saturday so make sure you check that out it should be a ton of fun and yeah so i'm just trying to get this video out for thursday because i don't have much time to record so that's why we're recording just kind of like a random rigged match but hopefully it's a good match that we have a uh, punt on sex hitting and draws a ragged wolf rocket appliances i mean you could be greedy and play and sacrifice a rallying play a ragged wolf turn one and have a one two three four curve but personally i wouldn't i would probably i would still probably sacrifice the rallying yeah, he does. And yeah, not play the rival. So that's the exact play I would have done. Excalibur running purification. So it looks like tempo order. Um, you want to keep both Royal Skirmishers. If you see its growth, you're probably going to want to get rid of the Wings War. Wings War is good protection. Purification, you're going to want for like a big boss. But yeah, so Excalibur's run. Gets rid of the Wings War because um, against growth, there's not many targeted enchantments for you besides like Binding Root and stuff like that. Uh, okay, Sacrifice the Rat King. I, I would do that as well because. Um, I mean, it's good chump blocking versus order, but then there's also relentless and you got a veteran You got to keep the veteran uh, Probably here. I would sacrifice uh, the I, I don't agree with that. I, I want to keep both skirmishers skirmishers are so good. I would have probably sacrificed the purification Skirmishers are so good for brisk growth. They win games um, Now you have a forge up. So now you probably want to sacrifice the ragged wolf Interesting does not sacrifice the ragged wolf because if he sacrificed the Ragged Wolf, then he'll be able to play both of the Wolf next turn and then Veteran. But now he's stuck with just a Ragged Wolf next turn. And it's going to be hard for him to ramp up to the Veteran. Here he got a Wing Shield. That's really awesome. So that's a no. That's a. It's okay. Um, personally, I would have sacrificed the Purification or the Flip. Um, I think definitely getting a Wing Shield in front of uh, those two units is very important. I think I like exactly what he did right here. Not put the Wing Shield out first. Because you have this turn where there's a very small chance this thing's gonna die. It'd have to be like double ragged wolf or ragged wolf and some enchantment. Sacrifices the wildling for resource. I don't know why he's clinging to that ragged wolf so much. Just play the wildling. Or the brother of the wolf that you had the turn before. I mean, I don't know what, why he's clinging to that ragged wolf. Um, and he actually didn't have to sacrifice for resources there. Because. You have this this thing attacking the idol, so you're gonna have five resources anyway, so you can play that. And now Excalibur does not have a blessing of haste, so a good thing to do here, I think, would be to sacrifice purification for cards and see if we can get a, a blessing of haste or something. But he doesn't because he's, he's a focus too. So now he's just gonna play the wing shield in front. Totally fine. Or that. Mm, I guess I guess that's an equally good play. But I would probably rather get the wing shield out now because now he's he's vulnerable to the veteran this turn which i i'm sure rocket plants will do but he's rocket appliance is still behind though because, he, because excalibur has a relentless unit attacking next turn there's nothing 
Rocket Appliance can do to stop that. He could go with a Brave Stack Heart near the top and just try to come back that way. But I think, yeah, the Veteran's safer. And you really shouldn't put this guy behind because there's going to be something like a Focus or something to get rid of that. So I think you sacrifice for resources. Yeah, that for resources. Wing Shield in front and focus on the Skirmisher so you can call all that stuff. And then you have another, and then you have a nice, uh, you can play the Vanguard next turn, which would be awesome for Excalibur. Uh, I do think Aggro Order generally beats uh, Aggro Growth, generally. Sacrifice is the, the uh, uh, Wild Wing, interesting. And it's fine, I mean. I probably would have played the Wild Wing and Brave, though. But he plays, now he's, has a, he's trying to come back here with a, probably a double Brave and a uh, Better. Um, obviously, Rocket Appliance doesn't know that Excalibur has uh, Purification in his deck, which would be good against like a triple stack card or Brave. And now let's see. So Excalibur probably does the smart thing here and is just going to play the Vanguard right in the middle. He could have sacrificed for Scrolls and hoped to top deck something to be able to destroy the Braves, but I think it's a much smarter play just to do that. And here, interesting, he keeps the stag heart and sacrifices the, I think he definitely want to keep the creature, but luckily for him, he did get another brave, but he's not able to do anything this turn. He can't destroy any of his stuff. Yeah, they're just going to get absorbed by the wing shield. I don't know why you would do that, because now, just if Excalibur has anything like a focus or something, or a blessing of haste, yeah, just simply a blessing of haste would just clear his board. Because of the um, not clear sport, but he's the Vanguard buff. So, Rocket Appliances. I don't know if he forgot about the Wing Shield uh, being able to um, being able to absorb hits like that. But or you could just have Eternal Sword on you, and then that works as well. Honestly, I would probably just blessing of haste him, move you down, and then put the Wings Captain right in the middle. Yeah, it looked like that's going to be a very good play there. Pretty optimal because then you kill everything besides this better and you have like so much board control. And it doesn't look like Rocket Appliance is running quick because he doesn't have Fertile Soils either, he's more very aggro. And he already lost a stag heart, so may as well. Yeah, that's that's the game. Um, there was nothing Rocket Appliances could really do to come back there. Uh, yeah, so that was, that was extremely short. Um, but I think that's gonna be it. I really had to record a video kind of fast because I don't have much time to record. That's why there's gonna be no video on Saturday or Sunday, but there is gonna be the top plays because I already made that. But um, yeah, so I'll have to, this will have to do for the video. Maybe next time I'll try to record a higher rated match. But um, yeah. So thank you all for watching. Submit your top plays to me. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want more content like this. And I will see you tomorrow for top plays of the week, so make sure you check that out. Keep on scrolling, everybody.